What is up you guys? It's Katya Books. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to another supplement review. I'm sorry to those who really wanted me to do a pre-workout, but your girl was kind of low on a protein, which I did end up ordering some more of my Sun Warrior, but I was like, we also got to try a new one for you guys. And luckily, a brand that I feel like is fairly popular came out with a vegan protein. Only one flavor, unfortunately, but hey, it's a vegan protein, so we're moving in the right direction with all this plant-basedness going on in the universe. But anyways, you guys saw from the title, we are trying NLA for hers vegan protein powder. I feel like this is a brand that so many like social media, Instagram influencers like have been part of. So at first I was kind of like, oh my gosh, this is just such a a brand that all the girls, you know, are now like sponsored or affiliates by. So I I was just I don't know I don't know how I felt about it. <laughs> but then again, now I'm affiliated with Sunwear because then again I love them and I genuinely love them. Um, even though there's certain supplements they don't carry, I'm still like stuck on them. So they're my favorite. But anyways, but that doesn't mean I can enjoy and look, try other brands. So regardless of Sun Warrior, I will try this with a completely open mind because hey, I can admit I've had flavors that are way better than Sun Warrior. So then again, I just said then again, like I don't know how many times, but forget it. This flavor is vanilla chai latte. So that's a flavor that I don't think I've quite tried. I have seen chai flavors i think one or two have done but it's been quite a while so i'm pretty stoked but kind of surprised they don't have just like vanilla and chocolate like everyone does that but just to have one flavor i don't know it's kind of odd maybe they're just testing the grounds with how well it sells so let's see how it tastes but anyways i want to read just quickly the calories macros all that fun stuff so it's 160 calories uh six fat wow that's a lot for protein powder 10 carbs and 21 protein so kind of interesting that I have a lot of fat i feel i feel like that's a lot of fat i don't know what do you guys think because usually it's like lower than like at most i've seen like four or five i feel like but whatever so it's a pea protein hemp protein and rice protein blend it also has a fiber blend and a performance superfoods blend, which is pretty cool, and digestive enzymes and probiotic blend. So this seems like a really nice all-around protein compared to other brands where it's just your straight up pea protein and brown rice protein mixed just to have pre-workout <coughs> PE science. But anyways, we are going to open this up and try it out. So where's my, ah, haha. We're gonna do a mason jar test because I don't know. I want to see how well it mixes without a shaker ball. I feel like that's the ultimate test. So yes, let me measure this out real quick and then we'll get to it. All right, so I'm mixing this up, but I want to show you guys something crazy. You have to look at the size of the scooper. Like compared to my head, this is humongous. This is like two times bigger than a normal scoop. And I forgot to mention that it is only 20 servings and I know it costs like more than $30 so definitely more than a dollar per serving which is honestly pretty expensive so that's why not only can you know Sun Warrior give you more but there's a coupon code sorry for the, all the plugs but anyways I also want to mention I found it kind of odd that it didn't tell you the sugar because sometimes I do that when I'm like entering it into my fitness pal and for some people maybe tracking sugar it does not say that but anyways I thought that was just kind of interesting and that it's 44 grams that that was that huge scoop so hopefully this mixed well we'll see I mean it looks pretty good I would think it smells pretty good from when I opened it up but oof, let's try it out open mind we'll see all right Ooh. All right. Oh my gosh. Okay. No, smells very light. Okay. Mm. This is really nice, actually. 
it's really really good I would say subtle soft like the hint of cinnamon all spice kind of that you get from chai is definitely in it and so I can solidly say it tastes like vanilla chai this is delicious I would say that it's mixed very well it's mm, very 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 tiny 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 grit nothing unbearable whatsoever it's still fairly smooth not as smooth as that collagen protein that i tried last review but definitely drinkable for anyone because i know a lot of people who aren't vegan who try to find vegan proteins because whey messes with their stomach tend to not like plant-based protein because they're always like it's super gritty and so it might bug someone in that case go with something smoother like some warrior otherwise like if you mix this with like a smoothie you are not going to tell the texture whatsoever so that's you can totally disregard it but yeah i will mention that i didn't find any kind of coupon code um they don't seem to give them to their affiliates so i had to pay full price for this and it was like almost 40 bucks so it's almost two dollars per serving yeah plus shipping so it definitely came out to more than 40 dollars so i'm kind of peeved about it but i do this to try it for you guys because i saw it and i was like oh dang this brand came out with new vegan protein had to try it for you guys but it tastes really good but I, I think you can get better value for your dollar but if you have money to spend feel free to try it i mean i definitely i'll give it an eight out of ten the two points less just because of price otherwise it's very good all right my friends my fit fam you guys heard it from me the peanut butter queen the protein supplement Guru, I don't know what you want to call me, but I feel like it's been, wow, almost three years that I've been on YouTube and it all started because of supplement reviews and here I am today still finding awesome, awesome supplements, which yes, I did very much love it. Will I buy it again? No, because it's really expensive and yo girl like has had so many medical bills that she can't just afford the luxury of buying this, but if you could afford the luxury, I said give it a try. If you're like, oh my god, I have to have my vanilla chai latte protein powder. Like, oh my god. But then again, you can actually make your own. If you want me to turn a regular vanilla protein powder into a vanilla chai, let me know down below. And I will do that recipe for you guys. And it will be super easy and probably better macros. Because, yeah, it's like half of it is carbs. So if you're on a low carb diet, oh, I don't know. And this is higher in fat, so mm, the macros are like so-so. But anyways, if you enjoyed this video, you know what to do. Give it a nice big thumbs up. And if you are new to my channel, welcome, first of all. And don't forget to subscribe and join the Fit Fam. I don't know what I have next for you guys. I might actually have my one month update on my nose. So yes, if you haven't seen my last video regarding my nose job please go check it out and on that video leave your questions because i'm going to be doing like a q a so stay tuned for that so click the notification bell as well i don't know why i'm talking like this okay love you guys i'm gonna go before i go even more crazy okay bye <laughs>